It all began with a raise before the flop, then a re-raise, a few folds, then a call. Jack 410 with two hearts hit the flop. Check, bet, and call. The ace of hearts hits the turn. Bet, and a big raise. Now the real game begins. Doyle just double-checked his whole cards. It doesn't look like he has a flush. Chris is showing a lot of strength. He might have a marginal hand. What's taking so long? Let's go. Wow, Doyle's doing a lot of talking over there. This could be a bluff. You make the flush, Doyle? Chris is fishing for information. He must have two pairs. I think you got me. That's poker, folks. On the bad end of those swings, stuck one hundred eighteen and one hundred fifteen thousand dollars respectively. I was gone. Yeah, Howard Letter is stuck sixty-seven thousand. Phil Ivy, a virtual spectator, up about thirteen grand. Elia Lesra, the same, up about twenty-five thousand. And the big winner, Tom Dewan. With over a half a million in his stack is up over two hundred and sixty thousand dollars. I was gonna be all nitty and fold too. Now I just don't have a choice. Three players will take the flop. Big flop for Phil Ivey. Top pair, top kicker. Middle pair for Tom Dwan. And a Broadway draw for Patrick Antonius. Interesting hand at uh, Benfield. Benfield, whatever he's in. Flop three sixes. Flop is king six six again. And don't have king jack on it. So he put him on ace king. So he called a big bet on the flop and a big bet on the turn. Raise him on the river. The river, the guy jack. But jack came, so he make him feel. Durr folds his jacks. So, no, actually, bet the river and do raise him big. Ivy and Antonius and add 22,000 to the pot. Yeah, he, he bought one, I think. He's really into a bunch of real estate stuff. Real estate, yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Like buying uh, low rent condos and that kind of stuff and selling them out, and then I think he's buying his own place. Oh, well, that's nice for 21 years old, 22 to be involved with like He's 22, I think. Yeah. 22, yeah. And he's just getting in now, though. I mean, after the after the decline. Uh, I think he got in a little bit before. He should wait at least <laughs> well, another five years. <laughs> that's right. Another that's five years one. of market. That's a good one. Yeah. Bet and a call of twenty-seven thousand dollars on the turn. You don't need anything. You need poker. Well, I mean, that's, like, I think he'd make more money if he... Over $91,000 in the pot. And didn't take money out of it. Oh, Patrick has fired two barrels already. I mean, obviously he'll make He will not control. fire the third, however. Ivy rolls over his ace-king, and he'll take it down. Jeez, how many black chips you got? I'll have to buy two of them. Alari might only post 100, 200. You never know. Yes or no? <laughs> yes or no? It's <laughs> okay. No? What? No. Ah, uh, no. 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 Uh, he's he's cheating. He appears to pick whenever. It's not good for me. Somet somehow I feel like he has an advantage. No I like how you were saying yes or no. <laughs> and Alari thought you meant the blinds. <laughs> and he realized. I know, I can lose like 1.5 million, but I can win only 100k, 10 on. <laughs> Ivy has made it 5,000 to go. Antonius defends his straddle. Ivy's got the best hand on the flop. Thank you, Tom Duan. Antonius has got a wheel draw. You're welcome, Mr. Elizra. What are you thanking me for? Hmm? For laying down your diamond. No problem. You, I don't know. When you walk away, twice they came again. And the seven. Actually, no, you missed one hand. You saw it, I guess. 
tell you. You know, Phil took him as a partner. Phil took him as a partner. Just take it. He would win so much for the 50%. Just First take time it. time in your life, the, the spookiest man in the world. I just checked and folded you every time I guess. said no. I said yes. Just wanted to try. take a piece of him in a coin flipping game. Your favorite player, yeah. right? And you said no. We'll return to the Golden Nugget with more of NBC's Poker After Dark after this. It's time for more Poker After Dark. Phil. <laughs> too much. How are we doing? It's not good. You don't want people to lose all yeah, the money. You up 25. To to you want the game to go every day. And we yeah, down yeah. 10 and 15. So everyone's, everyone's doing well that, but you. That would be great. You, you ought to be up at least 50 by now. Let's stop with the props. Let me think about it. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think nothing's gonna happen anyways, right? All right. So it's so 10, 20. The props and are double. Come on. All right. We, for this we, everything's double. It's easy. Okay. Yeah, everything is double. Okay. Now is when I when I shine. Four players in for eighteen hundred a man. Oh, this, so what's we that? said next that's hand, a, right? No, 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 no. That's a ten one. That's a ten ball. That's twenty. Good Told day. you when I shine. No. What are the? Oh, seven hearts. <laughs> Duan's got aces. Uh, Ivy's got sevens. Betting a call of 5,700, and Ivy spikes two pair on the turn. Over 19,000 in the pot. Dwan reaches for chips and fires 14 6. Ivy just calls. Tom appearing more confident about his hand after Ivy just called the turn. Five of clubs on the end. Unlikely to have helped either player. And Duan bets 38,300. How much is it? I assume that wins queen side. Yeah. yeah. No, Sam. Sam, it's not that easy to get paid off. We both have hands so much. I probably fold. Maybe. Yeah. I probably do. Maybe. Maybe. So seven is one point. Isn't it? It's, 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 in the side is one point. Okay. Ellie and Hillary limp in, and Ivy juices it up to 3,000 with Jack-9 suited. Dewan, perhaps seeking a bit of revenge, calls with 9-7 suited. 
Ellie and Hillary along for the ride, and four players will take the flop. Top pair for Phil Ivey, but a set of sixes for Ellie Alesra. Ellie check calls nine thousand dollars. <laughs> Ivy bets twenty six thousand. Ellie's got to love this. He min raises to 52. Ivy quickly folds, and Elezra takes the pot. Hmm. Momentum was in Phil Ivy's corner until that pot. Back with more poker after dark in a moment. It's time for more of NBC's Poker After Dark, The Cash Game. Again, blinds at three and 600. Ante still at 100. Big winner in the game, still Tom Dwan. Despite losing a pretty big pot to Phil Ivy. Ivy now up over $80,000. Big loser in the game continues to be Patrick Antonius, who's down over 150,000. If anybody ever tip you 20 more dollars, oh good. So now. Tony is trying to pick up what he probably thought was dead money. Oh, you limp to six and you gave it up? Wow. Hillary and Phil call. Pair of threes for Sahamius out in front. Patrick bets 7,000. Hillary quickly calls. Ivy out of the way. Heads up now. No action on the turn. Both players check the river. Zygmunt shows his threes, and he'll take it down. He's chosen a straddle to 1,200. He'll have last action, Tom Dwan first now.
Patrick, Ellie, and Ivy all have some significant prop bet action on the side. There is. That could be influencing Ellie's decision to try to raise and take this pot without a flop. If spades hit the board, more. he wins. Ivy's got hearts, and Patrick's got clubs. With two spades in his hand, Ellie knows it's more likely that hearts or clubs will show up on this flop, so he's going to try to raise and take it down with no flop, and that's exactly what he does. See, that's the reason you do it. You have spades in your hand, you don't want, you know. I still want to wheel you in the game. I'll do it with you in 100, 200 games sometime. Yeah. But it's a little too high to land. Because I need to sit there and pause for 10 seconds and make it obvious what I have. <laughs> I knew once he's gonna get a winner, he's, he was not not gonna put the straddle anymore. You know, it just was obvious the guy. Folded around to Hillary in the small blind, he just limps with pocket eights. We gotta see some flops for these props. That's the only reason why I checked. <laughs> only, the only one. Bottom set for Hillary. He checks to Phil, who's got tens. I'm so bad at props. I really, I'm such a space <laughs> guy. and cheap both but the very first time he ever played, the very first prop he slept. That was amazing. Let's play the chat too. Hillary bets 1100. Phil drawing dead makes the call. No, that's, that's the last thing we take, the jack. And Ivy hits trip tens on the end. Hillary's got a full house. He's such a killer. Ivy raises Hillary's bet of fifteen hundred to six thousand. I mean, let's let's do it, but we'll get the double off, uh, Patrick. Hmm? Let's get take the double off and put the jack on me. Double so off? Yeah, because you know how much if you flop ace king queen off so triple, you're gonna lose hundred eighty each. It is too big, and I know Phil is a. We can take the diamond away for yes. example, for double. That's what we can do. How much is it? No, we don't want to do that. No, they are, see, if you they keep the diamond, keep the jack, then it's pretty big too. Hillary's re-raised it 20,000 more. You understand why? Because wow. the jack will bring us to a lot of double and triple. And then if you want for triple and you hit a 5-6-7 a spade or a 5-6-7 a club, each of us is going to have to pay you 40 times 3 is 120. And, and you know Phil, I don't have to tell you it's Phil, he's going to hit it. Ivy trying to figure out what it is that Hillary limped with. I think I'm going to, I'll keep the jack, but I don't want to play the double. His kicker no, does not play. No, it can be done. And jack's going to keep us with a lot of double and triple, so. He lays down the trips. Good fold, and Hillary takes the pot. Taking pots off Phil Ivy sure beats pumping gas. Welcome back to Las Vegas for more of Poker After Dark, the cash game. That was the match looking okay. good, okay? All right. And the jack is in. Blinds, please. Okay. Okay. That's right. fine. Okay. So, so you never go for yeah, triple. I mean, okay, then, suggest, then it's okay. Suggest, suggest. Did you ever say no? Is the, the stiff jack, jack in? 
Yeah, the jack just is. Bear down and just jack take is it, it. You know? So, so if you, if if there's like a, we know a, it's that below. If there's a if there's a jack of spades, alone, you pay for both of us, right? right? Yeah. Yeah. And it's make you. What happens if you are for double? You pay you pay double for us. Yes. I pay double. And so then how much is it? It's and if, a, it's a jack, if it's in the middle, how much is it? It's a ten, and if it's in the side, it's five. Okay, and double is thirty and ten. Yeah. We on. We are. Patrick renegotiating the props with Ivy. Meanwhile, Hillary flops a pair of nines. <laughs> I've seen a lot of diamonds today. I know, just, just diamond central. Diamond. <laughs> That's amazing time. how many diamonds came up. <laughs> Your partner gave up. You'll only be ahead about 300 probably right now. Yeah, what's 300? He gave, he said, he said, okay, no problem. Home. Howard limping in under the gun with his tens. And you know Doral can gamble. Actually, in the old days. What? Sahami is feeling frisky with Queen Nine off suit. He's won a couple of pots back to back. Howard Smooth calls. He'll be heads up. See it. What else is new? Deuce of Club, too. You say 100,000 for Deuce of Club? So what do you win? 20? Yeah, still double, yeah. Right. Two overcards to Howard's 10s hit the flop. Sahamius has position and control. Now lose 10, so I'm minus no, 5. He, yeah, you I mean, won 10 of each. Yeah, yeah, 10, 10 yeah, of each. I lose 10 and you lose 10. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He thought 20 of each. Yeah, I thought, yeah. yeah. You want to win more? No, I take the 20. I just couldn't figure he out how to win more. 20. You didn't see it? He wants all my money. He wants all my money, don't you? Tell you, just, you really, that would just make you happy. One loser, buddy. To see me on the street just washing windows. Two dollars make me happy. Just for a while, though. I usually have them for a couple of minutes and would you stake me give them double. Would you, would you stake double me after them and you give break them back? Hmm? All right, I'm putting the straddle only if Tom Duan put the straddle on, okay? I will. Say well. You will? Okay. You, you, you I'm 16, Zygmunt. You object? By the way, I, 16. I know you're going to put it on 16. Just kidding, okay. No 16, you mean 32. Okay. <laughs> No, it's more, guys. It's, hold on. Hang on, hang on. It's way more. Wait. 2448. 2448. Okay. Here. Go ahead. Let's make a game of this. You like it, Bob? Look what I started. Hang on. Hang on. Look what I started. Look Bob. what happens to my big blind. This oh, it's terrible. your big blind? Mm. I, get, I put 1200. That's you. That's you. That's you. This mm -hmm. is my button. Only fair. <laughs> Can I see those two cards? Save, save oh, give me here. the hundred. Here, give no, it to it's me. Yours. I'll give it to the nice dealer. Here, yeah. baby. That's for I'll you. Take it. It's fair. It's my button. It's nice. It's fair. You were gentlemen, and we never gave up on you. Go high. That's all I could tell you. Probably. <laughs> 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 uh, Did you look it? No. I didn't look it. Phil look. That's no, why he yeah. said go high. No? Girl didn't look as well. But he folded. I just folded dark. <laughs> just paid out 900 bucks and folded dark. Oh, what is this? Professor. Give me a pair of deuces. Howard has raised the blinds and straddles to 19,800. And two nines for Phil Ivey in the third straddle position. Come on, man. He's going to put Howard all in here. And Howard's got to wonder if Ivy isn't just trying to bully him here. Mm -hmm. 
Howard knows that Ivy might think he was just getting after the dead money. Over a hundred and five thousand more for Howard to call. Three to two. Let her really think in this one over. Huge decision. Howard's been in the tank now for over two and a half minutes. He folds and Phil Ivy takes the pot. I had you crushed, I promise. Um, why you want to let is not working for me do you have a different PA Tom Dwan still the big winner in the game followed by Elia Lezra and Phil Ivy not so far. Patrick Antonius the big loser also playing from behind Hillary Sahamius and Howard Letterer easy to have one. just too many of my days I don't do anything <laughs> what uh, you know no, wait, 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 sitting wait. there with some personal oh I was 12 24 48 that's correct that's correct I didn't do anything. No, I, need, no, I was thinking well, if maybe the blind wasn't right, but it was right. It's three, six, twelve, right? Yeah, it's worth it. Yeah. I, we the button, I mean. She's going to show you in a second. Raise the 4,500. Picks up the kids at school. She, she runs those kind of errands. But. I don't need someone to, like, book my travel or drive me around or anything. Ivy raises up front to 4,500. Sahamius defends with the better of the two aces. First double of the day. How did you know? Open-ended straight draw for Hillary. Pair of sevens for Ivy. If eight of club would be there. Where's the eight of club? Both players check. Board pairs on the turn. Ivy picks up the nut flush draw. Okay. I'm going to have tens next time, I've decided. And that's the key to this game. It's having the tens when they have the nines. Sahami has bet 7,500. So bad if you had seven, sir. You're right, I shouldn't have folded, just in case. Ivy calls. I can't win if you fold. And there's Thief Jack. That's what I've learned from... We should have played the turn in the river as counting. But I've made my... Yeah, but you know, it's, no. it's going to influence so much the game because if I have a... I know, I know, I know, I know. You can't do it, but that would have been a big, big board there. 
Oh, I got my prop. Three, four props in that board. Hillary folds and Ivy takes it down. I'm down 50. All right. How much did you win there, genius? 40. No, I mean more, right? I got 10, 10. Only four, right? You want more? Only one. Only you four. want more. You always you want, want more, do you? Welcome back to Las Vegas for more of Poker After Dark, the cash game. I didn't know that. I just remembered it. How many have I slept in these? <laughs> Honestly. Yeah. No, I don't know. I don't care if I slept. It doesn't bother me like that. Like it does you guys. You bother uh, Tom Dua? It bothered me. I should just play props. I think sleeping is lucky. By the way, <laughs> really lucky. I honestly believe that. Look, look how you're doing today. I'll try to do it more in the future. Play props till I sleep one. Quit down like 10,000 each time. I think sleeping is steaming. You gotta fight through that sleep. I'll tell you one thing, if I get stuck at 100, I'm gonna be limping a lot of bots to get some, get some flops out there. Four and eight, or three and six. Next ten, five one. Next ten, what? Five one. With two hundred empty. By the time we finish this week, we'll be, no, 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 no. We'll we'll be pick in, it up. We'll, we'll, we'll we'll we got to play at least thousand. an hour or so of each level. We'll be in two four thousand yeah. by the time we we'll finish. Sorry. We just kicked it up. You have about a hundred or? Yeah, a hundred. Double. What are you in there? I'm telling you, you should play with the diamond. It's wild if you're... 20. Hold on. Now we wait for what? Because we play double stakes. You win, I want, you, win I, you know, you know, how much, you know how much I you want 80 before. My double was 80 before, and now I want 40. Because of seven and the clubs, and we play 10 each, and double is 20 each, so it's 20, 20, 20, 20. Right. It's 80. So I want more. Now it's 40. So just, so mar just mark now. Uh, just mark, just mark 80. 80 now. Back with more cash game action when we return to Las Vegas. We return to the Golden Nugget with more of Poker After Dark, the cash game. I have 160 here. What's a lot? That's a lot. 160. That's not How much you up? 180. 200? Huh? 200. How much? I'm up like 30,000 maybe. No, I never seen me seen you losing the hand. In fact, Ivy's up over a hundred thousand, <laughs> but that's in the poker, not the props. He likes to try to jinx me. You should play with the triple. You should go for a triple. <laughs> okay. I just play the props. Two pocket pairs and Ellie's king four suited take the flop. Double. Flush draw on the flop for Ellie. Howard six is in the lead. Six, 
Flop checked all the way around. Ivy checks a second time. Letter of six is still best. And he bets a paltry 2,500 into the pot. Elezra makes the call. Genius. So you win 40? Three of a kind on the board now. Howard's hand still best. He'll check it. Fifty to Zygman, eighty-five to you. Gonna be one of those days. I stole your twenty-five hundred. Ellie won't bluff at it. Howard takes it down. Wanna run it up? Huh? Play is complete for the night in our poker room. Tomorrow, the action resumes with our group of top guns. For Ali Najad, I'm Leanne Tweeden. Good night from Vegas. Tomorrow on Poker After Dark, the cash game. Can I be right? Don't take it. Hey, that's not right. That's my that's not that's right. friend. <laughs> so I don't, I don't take it. Here. Here. Don't do anything don't stupid. Look. Don't look. Don't look. I want to be right. Poker After Dark accommodations provided by the Golden Nugget Hotel and Casino, Las Vegas.